I'm Laura McKenzie, and welcome to a look at some of the most beautiful and romantic destinations in the world. From beaches to safaris to five-star resorts, I'm going to show you some of the best. But remember that romance isn't found just in a place. It's created with a mood, and ultimately, the experience lies within ourselves. So join me as I show you a few places like London, Monte Carlo, and Austria, to name a few. But first, a look at one of my favorites, the romance and beauty of Thailand. Thailand. To most Westerners, it's a colorful and exciting country. Not to mention, it's just about as exotic as you can get. Ancient culture exists here side by side with modern society, peacefully coexisting, each respectful of the other. The effect? A feast for the senses, an assault of visual stimulation. So whether you're here for a few days of shopping in Bangkok or an elephant trek into the jungle, Thailand is an experience that you'll never forget. For excitement and great photos, don't miss one of Thailand's exotic markets, especially Bangkok's weekend market, one of the best. Now, the weekend market is different from any other market here in Bangkok. I know there's 100 markets here, but the weekend market is different because, one, it's only open on Saturday and Sunday, and two, it's like a big department store. You've got different areas. You've got an area for books. You've got an area for, for dogs and cats and pets. You've got an area for antiques. You've got clothes. You've got electronics. So you go to each little section. I love it. For a real Thai experience, head for the wildlife. This is a true assault on the senses, including sights, sounds, and smells, where you'll discover everything from a cute little puppy you'd love to take home to not-so-cute little creatures you'd rather be without. And if it's exotic sights and aromas that you're after, the different kinds of food they sell is, in one word, amazing. So whether it's clothing, watches, purses, or whatever, there's plenty to shop for in Bangkok's markets. At the other end of the spectrum, Bangkok is equally famous for its five-star hotels. In fact, there are few places in the world that can top the accommodations that Bangkok has to offer. In a city known for its luxury hotels, there's one that stands alone in service, style, and location. Shangri-La means paradise found. And the Shangri-La Hotel in Bangkok is definitely that. Set on beautifully landscaped grounds, the award-winning Shangri-La is the largest riverfront resort on the Chao Phraya River, an oasis right in the heart of the city. The immense lobby lounge with its commanding river view is an opulent welcome to Thailand and the perfect setting for a leisurely afternoon tea accompanied by the hotel's pianist or entertaining Sunday brunch complete with both music and magic. The rooms are magical as well, decorated with traditional Asian fabrics and artwork that create an authentic Thai ambiance. Whether you choose a suite or guest room in the main hotel or the exclusive Kruntep wing with its own entrance and reception lobby, you'll be surrounded by elegance and luxurious amenities including international direct dial phones, color televisions with in-house movies, in-room coffee and tea making facilities, and mini bars with complimentary mineral water. Bathrooms are luxurious as well, many with deep soaking tubs, additional phone lines, plush terry robes, and scented toiletries. Towering 25 stories high, the Shangri-La offers amazing views of the Chao Phraya River and its desirable location is central to all the sights and wonders of Bangkok, as General Manager Richard Chapman explains. Being able to go upstream and visit the Royal Palace, or over to the Wat Arun, or the museum where you've got the Royal Barges, everything is so much at hand. You really see the character and flavor of the city, particularly when you take a long-tail boat and go through the Kalongs and see how the local people really live. The hotel makes this particularly easy for guests with its own jetty right outside the back door where you can hail a long-tail boat just as you would a taxi or catch the Shangri-La's own complimentary water shuttle. After a day of sightseeing, relax by one of the pools or take a leisurely walk around the tropical gardens to work up an appetite for a great meal in one of the hotel's six restaurants. The Salatif serves beautifully prepared Thai cuisine in a lovely waterside setting. Guests have a choice of dining inside on one of the three teak salas or outside on the patio with its ever-changing parade of passing boats. 
The meals are a stunning blend of preparation and presentation, making it a very popular spot with hotel guests. Another popular spot is Angelini. Authentic Italian cuisine is served in a stunning tri-level architectural setting that's perfect for those looking for a more contemporary dining experience. For a more casual option, the Coffee Garden is famous for its incredible buffets, as well as its Asian and international specialties served a la carte 24 hours a day. Service is attentive not only in the restaurants but throughout the hotel and lives up to the extraordinary standards set by the gracious people of Thailand. I think that Thailand and Bangkok in particular has gotten a name as, as having some of the leading hotels in the world, and quite rightly so because of the incredible uh, service levels which, which one finds here, the individual uh, attention which is provided to each and every guest. With its magnificent setting, wonderful culinary options, and exemplary service, the Shangri-La Hotel definitely lives up to its name, Paradise.